I've died a few times in a few different projects, and my dad hates it. Like if <laughs> if he 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 makes me tell him if I'm gonna die, so he'll be prepared. But I never do. And then afterwards, he always God damn it, shit. Why you? Hello. Hey man. <laughs> Hello. Good to meet you. Uh, first of all, congratulations. The movie is hilarious. I, I've said this in every single one, but I mean it every time. I had such a great time watching the movie uh, in a, with a, a, a bunch of people in the screening room, and I look mm -hmm. forward to watching it in, you know, in the wild with, with a, a much bigger group of people, you know? For sure. Um, so, okay, let's go, go back to, to the beginning. How does one get this movie does your cigar chomping agent you know they go oh you gotta you gotta read this or is it more personal than that for myself yeah my my agents brought it to my attention was like you you should read the script it's really really funny i started reading it um i reached out to the casting director who i you know uh leah daniels and she was like cool i'm gonna just put you through uh to tim and then from there it's just kind of understanding the character and, and you know just just playing your version of that and hope, hoping to get selected. Like winning the lottery, I guess. You never know. You never know. Um, it's a breakthrough comedy, man. It's a, it's a breakthrough horror comedy. Nobody's ever done it before. It's different. Um, it speaks to a lot of, it speaks to a, it speaks to a lot of different flavors of black folks, you know? That was attractive. Um, Tim Story, of course. Uh, I, I work. I work with Tim Story right along, um, and he, of course, he he directed White Famous. So we had built up a rapport. And then um, I had just done a movie with Senqua, so I got the call about it, <clears throat> and I read it, and I said, oh, "Okay, cool. This is all right, cool." Because I've done another horror comedy before for Hulu, and um, yeah. That uh, that was cool, but you know, it ain't it ain't like this. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody that was involved in that one, but it's not it's, it's not this one. So that's what read it and uh, and was really connected to it, and I thought it was really innovative. It's a comedy, but you got some blood and guts. You're walking <laughs> around with arrows sticking out of you. Yeah. Uh, I, I imagine if, if I were ever in a, in a movie and I showed my mom a picture of me with bloody makeup and an arrow sticking out of me, she'd grab a rosary and start reading prayers in Spanish. Um, <laughs> do, do you ever get like, like, oh, I want to show someone, you know, this horrific gore makeup, but they'd be like, oh, no, they wouldn't. Uh, they, wouldn't um, they wouldn't get it. Yeah, I, I've died a few times in a few different projects and my dad hates it. Like if if he 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 makes me tell him if I'm gonna die, so he'll be prepared. But I never do. And then afterwards, he always God damn it, shit. Why you? And he, he gets pissed off. Um, but yeah, yeah. So that's how it is with him. Um, I <laughs> I couldn't say it. I I wanted to I wanted to send some stuff, but I couldn't for contractual obligations. I wasn't. You know what I mean? I I ain't want social media. I ain't want them. You, you did for a second. I did. What? Huh? Yeah. yeah, yeah. For like it literally like it was it was like a. It was like it was like thirty minutes. <laughs> thirty minutes. I had something up, and then they got. And they were like, "You gotta take that down." I was like, "I got it. I'll take it down." So yeah, Melvin, your character in particular has so much uh, uh, backstory that that I feel like like I, I could take him to spin off city. <laughs> uh, I'm sure you could if if you wanted to. Um, is there any like kind of insight to your character, or even just to how you played him? That uh, that you could share with us. That's not necessarily spelled out to the viewer when they watch it. He's just somebody who's trying to create a new. Um, he wants his friends to see him for who he is now and not who he was before, because um, he's been struggling with trying to shed that old identity and grow up as we all do. And um, his friends just keep thinking he's that guy that he was in college. Um, so it, he's kind of battling with that against um, everything else that's going on. He's a truly wonderful character. The thank movie you. works on so many different levels. Thank, uh, you, thank, thank you so much, both of you, for the film. I can't wait to watch it again. Thank you. Uh, we appreciate it, man.